Hey guys, I'm April from gettingmiketogether.com and today I wanted to work on making over this desk. <laughs> I have been working on this desk for a while now and um, I, I'm, I'm ready, I'm ready to finish. I'm ready to finish the job and I'm so excited. So if you have a small desk or a small space that you're working with for your home office and you need some ideas, I definitely think you'll get some today from this. Um, this is a small desk. Like I see all these things and they're like, don't store this on your desk and don't store this on your desk. And, and really there should be nothing stored on your desk. And I'm like, I have two feet. Literally, I have two feet. <laughs> you can see this is my desk. And this is kind of midway through the project. This isn't the before, this isn't the after. This is midway. And I, yeah, on the other side of my desk, there's a fireplace. And when I turn this to try to show you, it didn't work. Fireplace, other side, a little mini wall, and then my dining room, because I work at home. And so this is just tricks that might work for your home office. So the first thing I did was work on decluttering this and I made like two or three videos about decluttering my desk last year. It was such a thing I had to work on because I've just started working from home seriously and I, I need a nice, beautiful space to, you know, you just need a, a, a happy place to work. So we're gonna make this a happy place. And um, I decided to first pick a color scheme. Once I got the clutter out, most of it, um, I was like, okay, I'm gonna go with, this is gonna be my girly corner. The rest of the living room is blue and white, but this is my girly corner and it's pink. And so I got that little pink planner. That is a real plant that I've kept alive and it's, I'm just so excited about it. And um, I don't have a computer that takes up a ton of my space because I use a laptop. And I gotta show you how cute is my laptop. <laughs> I'll link it below too. It's just a MacBook cover that I ordered on Amazon. Anyway, so the first thing I did after decluttering, getting a lot of the stuff out that I absolutely don't use, is go on a search for um, storage units. And so I'll show you what I found. So going with a pink, I got this file box because I have just a drawer here and I was using a basket for files, but it wasn't working. So this is so much better and I can only like I, this is obviously only a small file station so i only keep my most frequently used files in it and that's working out really well <laughs> and then i had a really big problem with piles accumulating on my desk and um first i had to go through all those piles which i hated but i did it and um then i bought this thing i'm gonna show you this thing it's a lighter pink but it's still pink and i found it on amazon and I just thought it was really neat. And it was so small that it will keep me from having giant piles because it won't hold a giant pile. So I just have like stuff I have to file in here and there's only two sheets. And I've been using this for a month or so, maybe even two months. So that's amazing that I only have two things in here. <laughs> and then the other stuff, it's kind of the same place. I, I really, it has slots for other things. I stuck this light because you know I make videos in here, but it's really too small for that slot. Maybe I could stitch it. And post-it note, it's a really great little thing because it's got three little containers and that has a drawer at the bottom and I'm keeping some important stuff in there. So I do, I do like this thing. Now I'm not saying it's perfect. Um, it would be great if I had like a thing I can mount on my wall, but we're renters and I, I don't want to mess up the walls that much. I don't even know how long I'll be living here because we're military and it's nuts. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna put this down. And as you can see, I still have some work to do. I'm gonna do it on this video. I'm gonna use for this cord problem I have. Oh, it's such a massive cord problem. This is Verizon's fault. Look, I'll show you what Verizon did to me. Okay, do you see that in the corner there? Look at those massive. <sighs> anyway, Verizon did that to me. They brought their little giant tower dumped it off and and just like I don't even know why why are there so, so many cords anyway I'm gonna fix that with a clip now I know there's like these cord things you can get and they're magical and wonderful and long it's a tiny space like I don't need anything long and also I don't want to spend money so I'm gonna clip them <laughs> and uh and then I'm gonna go through this drawer and I'm gonna go through this drawer today and I've been in the process of accumulating more um organizing bins. So I got this one at Target and it was super cheap. And I thought I bought two, but for some reason when I went looking for it, I could only find one. So there's that. Pretty sure I also got this at Target. And this is just a shoebox bin, but I might need it for that bigger drawer. I'm not sure. 
hanging file folders because anything I use super frequently really needs to have a file so I can access it quickly. I'm a fan of those. That's how my mom taught me to organize. <laughs> okay, and then I was at Hobby Lobby this weekend and I got these and they were on sale for 40% off. So I don't know when that sale ends. Probably over by the time I post this. But anyway, <laughs> I was excited. That was the first weekend in March I got these on sale 40% off. I noticed a lot of these desk organizing videos are all about 30 different colors of pens and markers and highlighters. Everything I design is on Canva. <laughs> I don't need 30 kinds of pens and markers and highlighters. So, not necessary. Um, this is my grand pen solution. Y'all, we went to um, someone's business office the other week, and uh, it was like a 70-year-old a man's office, and I just loved it. He had his pen cup, and it was like a Dixie paper cup. <laughs> I was like, oh, this man designed his own office. He, he handles his own decor, and it was so charming. <laughs> but anyway, so mine doesn't go with my pink, and maybe eventually I'll change that, but it's also Wonder Woman. And either my husband or my kids gave this to me for like a birthday or Mother's Day. And so, yeah, I'm planning on keeping it. And also, I, I like considering myself Wonder Woman, don't you? So, I keep my scissors and my pencils and my pens and my highlighters in here. And this is all I need on any given day. I'm not, I don't need a drawer full of 30 different colors of pens. <laughs> I think those are pretty. I think they're pretty. But I have two feet of space. So, <laughs> it's not going to happen. I am, I am exaggerating. It's, it's three feet definitely three feet of space okay so I have that and when we finish today I will have this way more cleaned off and um, pleasing to look at and then I have a drawer down here I'm gonna have to take this off to show you 100% before I haven't done anything to this drawer yet but it's just stacks stacks and st I don't even know what else. that's a file in there I didn't know that was in there stacks of stuff I need to deal with and then this drawer has important things. It, the cards people gave me, stamps, address books. This cord being so long is my fault. It goes to my laptop and um, I don't always keep it here. It goes around the house with me, so I can't really clip it and forget it. But it, just in case I brought a little clip and I thought, well, I can just make this part better. Um, and don't, don't think that I know what I'm doing here because I really don't, but I just, you know, I want it to be better. So, where did the little hair clip go? You know, now, you saw me just holding it. I was just holding it. Okay. Ah! <laughs> I found it. Okay. So, clippy. Ta da. Okay, that's just, that's my computer one. Okay, then I'm going to hide this as best I can back here behind it. Okay, so I clipped it. It doesn't really, I don't think it looks any better. I have to look at the before and after. The thing was just so tangled. So anyway, I keep it at the bottom. But when I put my chair in, you don't see it as bad. But that is the worst desk problem that I have. The rest, the rest is much better, I promise. I'm free. And now I feel super ready to organize. How fun is that? Okay, I'm gonna set this down. And let's deal with the top. Okay, that I still need. That's really important. Okay, these need to go in this drawer, the stuff that's on top, except for this. This is just a book I'm, I'm trying to read. <laughs> I haven't gotten around to it. I got some birthday cards for my birthday. Um, this, is, this is something that needs to be filed. And that is the sort of thing that I get, actually has to be responded to. So it goes in my inbox and that needs to be filed. And oh yeah, this was a good, that's for my teenager that needs to be dealt with. Okay, these are just napkins. I don't know why I have them here. Oh, hair supplies. Hair supplies are something I would like to have a little um, organizer for. So, um, <laughs> other people's desks. Beautifully, the different colors of pins. My desk. Ponytail holders. <laughs> okay, here is some random nut that goes to something. My husband would die if he saw what I really do with these. This this goes to the top of something. It says to throw it away, actually. No, I'm not making that up. Like, there's a little man in a trash can. It says to throw this away. 
I, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> my kids got me this for my birthday. It's a paperweight. No, for Christmas. It says mom. Anyway, so that, that gets to stay along with my pen cup and my plant and my water bottle for watering my plant. The candle doesn't have to stay though, although it is a really good one. All right, y'all, I am serious. I know it doesn't look like I'm taking this seriously, but I promise you I am. Okay, pencil. Easy. Um, these are important notes. Okay, so that goes in there. And then this, oh, this is something I really, 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 really have to do. Okay, really, really, really have to do's I can't put in the back of my inbox because it won't happen. If I can't see it, I won't do it. It has to stay on top of my desk. So I have one of these desktop calendars. So I'm just gonna put it on top of my desktop calendar. Then I'll put my computer on top of it. These notebooks need to go in the drawers. And there's just some more pens that I was messy about. And here's my coaster for when I actually have a drink. Ta-da! The top is cleared off. Now I know the tops of my files kind of look messy. Like when I'm looking at this, I'm like, oh, it would be neat if you didn't see inside my file box. But yo, I don't know a way to fix that. Oh, well, I guess, I guess if the stuff fit down into the files, it would look tidy. Okay, so we've done the top. We talked about the file cabinet. And look, if I push it to the back, it does look neater. Yeah, that kind of that kind of fixes it. And I stuck a book in here. <laughs> I don't even think this is a book that I need or use. But oh, it's it's ancestry notes. Okay, so I do genealogy studies sometimes, and this is where I can put that. And there's just enough room for a little book there. Okay, so now let's get into this drawer. Okay, as you can see, I now have a cleaned out drawer. Very exciting. <sighs> and honestly, extremely overwhelming because I'm not really sure. This needs to be like, I, I think this has one stamp left on it. That basically just means that I'm out of stamps. Okay, these are important personal things. I'm gonna put make that a stack over there. Um, these are important. They're my address labels. I'm gonna stop this a second and say that these are my favorite labels of all time. <laughs> They're Target brand rectangular labels that you can just write on. I get impatient with um, label makers. Okay, so these are things that I could put in that I could use a small organizer for. Okay, and this is my junk I found in this drawer that I need to file stack right here. Okay, and some of this doesn't even need to go back in the desk, like safety pins. I don't need those in here. I don't know why they're in here. These are nice for when I get better at filmmaking. <laughs> really isn't, did they? Do they fit? No, they're just the wide, too wide for that slot. Okay, so I'm going to remove that filing stack and I'm going to get a couple of organizers in here and see if I can fit this net notebook and then I'll show okay, you. These are the things that truly belong in this drawer. Some of my organizers were too tall for this, this drawer because it's pretty skinny, but that's okay because I can use them in my bathroom. So um, I have my address book, my budget organizer, and this loose leaf paper I found that I didn't even know I owned. But now I can see it so I know I own it. I can't stack things that are as big on it, as big as it is on top of it or I won't know it's there anymore. Okay. Then I put all of my little electronics in this little bin, and that's the like $1 Target one. My favorite labels and my sticky notes. And then over here, I have a notebook I use to keep up with business stuff and my own personal mail stuff. And so, there we go. I feel really good about how much tidier that is and how I know exactly what's in this drawer because honestly, before, I had no idea what was in this drawer. Unfortunately, I cleared out that much stuff. And that stack is like that thick. So now I gotta find a place for all so that So as stuff. it turns out, this was all stuff I just didn't wanna deal with filing in that drawer and a few notebooks. I'm excited when I find notebooks because at least I don't have to file those. <laughs> I hate filing. So we'll talk about filing for a minute. I just found a drawer full of stuff that I didn't feel like filing so I shoved in a drawer. If you're like me and you have a drawer like that, I'm so sorry. I feel your pain. Um, yeah. So, before I can do a final reveal on this desk, I have to actually file these papers. Or do I? <laughs> 
Okay, I've, I've set aside the stuff that actually needs to go. Well, I need to figure out exactly what needs to go in this drawer. And, um, and then when the video's done, then I'll file all the papers because that's going to involve a lot of downstairs work. Oh, and I, I meant to talk about the downstairs work because obviously you cannot fit an entire office into a three foot desk. Okay. This is not my whole office. So <laughs> I just have, I should explain also that I have four children and a husband and a house and a blog. Okay. So I, um, and I do other things. <laughs> Those are the main things. So I have a whole area downstairs where I keep excess school supplies, excess office supplies, most of my files, and um, my son's Xbox desk has a lot of little slots, and I store stuff in there too. So, this, if you have a small space, that is one big thing I advocate. Like, get your most important things you use all the time in one space so that you can just work, 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 and be happy. And then the extras, find another little space. <laughs> that's, that's my solution and get rid of as much as possible. But, um, obviously I can't get rid of all of my files and a lot of this is trash, thankfully, but a lot of it isn't. And I'm going to have to deal with it. And I have a file cabinet downstairs and it's a nice little file cabinet, but anyway, I have to keep it downstairs. It's sort of a basement, um, because I don't have room up here with my desk and I don't want to work down there in the basement. So, yeah. All right. I'm going to finish up this drawer, make it presentable, and then I'll show you the finished product of the desk. I'm come up with this one hack for small spaces that is going to pay off. I took this box, which I do, I do kind of need to make new files regularly, and I, I would love to have it up here, but this won't fit anywhere in this desk. It's so humongous. So, what I did is I took all the stuff inside, which as you can see is not the whole box of files because I'm down to like eight new files. Okay, I'm gonna take one of these hanging file folders and I'm going to put all of these extra hanging file accoutrements that you have to have to make a file folder in here. And I'm gonna put the extra file folder, which turns out I only have one, in here as well. That won't work if I don't label it because I won't know where to find it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take one of these out and make me a label that says file folders. And then I'm gonna hang the empty ones in the back of my daily use file box right here. And I think that is gonna make my life run a little smoother. And I am all for things that make my life run a little smoother. Okay, so you can see it says file folders and labels. <laughs> And I'm gonna stick it right here in my file folder and I'm going to, I have everything uh, alphabetized except for tax 2023 because it's tax time. So I have it at the front because it just makes sense. This isn't alphabetized at all. <laughs> okay, I lied. I thought I had it alphabetized. It's not, but I'm gonna act like it is and I'm gonna put it in here and fix it later. And I'm gonna put all these empty files in the back of the stack of files. Yay! Okay, let's put the finishing touches on it and wipe it off. Okay, so I've got my little plant, my little water for my plant, and my coaster. I know, I know, I know a lot of you think this is too much stuff for the top of the desk. But eventually I will get used to watering the plant enough to take away the water bottle. And um, yeah, I need the rest. So, okay. But I've gotten rid of all these stacks. I have so much filing to do because I found out about the hidden stacks. But um, anyway, I'll show you everything else. And then y'all think I have like total ADHD energy. Okay. So, ta-da! And there's a file. And I got rid of that book that was right there. And I tidied this up so it doesn't look bad. And if you push it back, you don't even see as much of that. But I like that it's pink. And like when you just look at it, it's just pink, pink, pink. And I like that. So... Yeah, I knew that was going to happen, but actually I have a couple more books in here to add and hopefully they won't fall down once I add those. But this one is the one I use the most. It's like my big blog planner. And I really, I just need to add like a little something. I'm trying to think if I still have a... Oh, I'm a Fanzel. This smells really, really good, by the way. And 
I think I sell these at Hobby Lobby this weekend too. Just to get for my friend Amy. Anyway, it smells really good and it'll keep my books from falling over when I open the drawer. Apparently, <laughs> and hey, if my stuff starts to smell like that candle, what an added bonus, right? So, all right, we'll try it one more time, make sure this works. And it's not very heavy. I tried a, a book weight first and it was, it was too heavy for that drawer. I'll break the drawer. Okay, awesome. Happy, happy, so happy. this is the finished product. I got that tidied up a little bit too. And the top is nice and clean now. <laughs> and then I have my file. And then I never really got a good visual on this drawer. But that's how this drawer ended up. And that's how it looks within the whole desk. I'm <laughs> running it all my table behind me. And then I just stacked up these notebooks like this so that I can fairly easily access them. That's a wrap for organizing my desk. <laughs> Thank you for coming along with me. I hope you got some good ideas for your own small space desk and uh, I'll see you next time.